All right, so here's a story here out of New York, but this is uh, written from Mabalacat City, Pampanga in the Philippines. PH means Philippine Consul General in New York, says woman knocked down by Filipino health worker. She insulted. A female Filipino health worker hit and knocked down an apparently racist woman inside an N Broadway Express train in New York City on Friday morning, which is Friday night in the Philippines, according to a Philippine Consul General. A woman picked on the wrong agent on the N train this morning, June 3rd. She spat on her hand and wiped her saliva on a young Filipino hospital worker seated next to her. She then saw a few <laughs> she then saw a few stars. Our Kababayan fellow Filipino comes from a family of boxing legends in the Philippines. Alma Cato, Philippine Council General in New York, treated on Saturday morning. Cato did not give further details, citing concerns about the safety of the female Filipino health worker. A woman picked on the wrong Asian on the end train this morning. She spat on her hand and wiped her saliva on a young Filipino hospital worker seated next to her. Now that is so disgusting. She then saw a few stars. <laughs> Our cop... Kababayan comes from a family of boxing legends in the Philippines. In a message to the inquirer, he said the Philippine consulate in New York has recorded almost 40 incidents of anti-Asian hate crimes and other criminal incidents involving Filipinos since 2021. These include a brutal attack on a 67-year-old Filipino woman inside her apartment yeah. in Yonkers City, New York State, on March 11. The victim, who was from the Ilocos region, sustained serious injuries to the head and face. I remember that. That guy was arrested. He lived in the, in the neighborhood in Yonkers. On March 15, Cato along with leaders of Asian American community and local officials held a news conference in front of the Yonkers City Hall to condemn the hate crimes against Filipino immigrants. We know authorities are doing their best to make the streets safe and again, but we also understand they could not be everywhere, but we do hope that authorities exert more efforts to remove violent and dangerous people off the streets and make everyone, not just Filipinos or other members of the Asian American community, feel safe again, he said during the event. Kata used to be the publisher and editor of the Angeles Sun, a Pampanga-based weekly newspaper and national editor of the defunct. Defunct meaning it's gone out of business. Not today, national newspaper. Well, that's interesting, you know, that this lady was able to turn the tables. Wow, oh, must be nice traveling with a woman like that. <laughs> Who can give somebody a blow and make them see stars, you know? That's a good story right there. Then all the ridiculous stories we've been hearing lately out, out of New York City.